everyone, I've got something really exciting to show you, and I pity the fool who does not take note of these items. They are new items from Milani Cosmetics, and the first two things I'm going to talk to you about are the Lip Intense Liquid Color. These things are absolutely beautiful. They are incredibly pigmented. Now, they say that there are gloss on them, but these are every month, every bit a liquid lipstick. Every bit of lipstick. I mean, they are just gorgeous. Actually, I don't they don't really say a gloss. They say liquid color, and that's what they are. Now, these are infused with with pure pigments. So you can only imagine the payoff of these. Now, they're a little thin, little thin container that will fit right in your pocket. You can put it right here in your bra. Nobody would ever know it was there. Gorgeous, gorgeous products. Now, let me show you the color on these. Um, they do have just a little doe foot applicator. Uh, that's got concealer, green concealer on my hand there. Sorry about that, but doe foot applicator. I do wish that it had a flat edge to it, but Eh, who cares? I'd probably dig it out of the tube if I had to with my finger. I love these so much. Now, I will show you a swatch. The two that I have were the only two that our, that our store had. They didn't have any other ones. Now, there are four in the line, and there is these two here, which are Pink Rave and Violet Addict, and then they have a Fiery Coral and a Red Extreme. So, you've got, you know, there's only four of them, but those four will pretty much encompass any look that you would have. So, it's pretty well thought out for, you know, for what it is, it's pretty well thought out because it pretty much cover anything that you did. But let me show you these beautiful colors. Now, this one here is Purple Addict. I mean, Violet Addict. <laughs> look at that beautiful payoff. That is unbelievable. I have never seen... Uh, I've never seen anything like this in this form. And that is Pink Rave. These are so incredibly gorgeous. Now, I put these on. I've been wearing these for several days so I can give you guys a legitimate review. And I put these on, I don't know, 8 or 9 in the morning when I get ready. And when I go to wipe it off, because you all know me, I don't keep my lipsticks on for, you know, 8 hours or anything. I think it's disgusting. After about an hour and a half or so, I feel like I'm constantly worrying about how it looks on my thin lips, you know. So I wipe it off and just reapply it. That works best for me. That's how I do things. And these things have a really good stain to them. And I like that. I'm going to put the Purple Addict on so you can see. Oh, oh look at that. Mm. Oh my gosh, it's like sex in a tube. Oh, Mwah. look at that gorgeous color. Now, if I only had something that would keep it from running into my lines. <laughs> Anyways, there's four. Once again, there's four in the line. Um, they cost $6.49. You get almost almost one ounce it is or one, almost a half an ounce it's point two oh well I guess that's only a third isn't it <laughs> but still you're getting a lot of product for the color payoff you don't need that much and you don't have to use it as heavy and strong as this um, when I use it I actually shear it out a little bit I'll put just a couple dots on my lips and then shear it down to a nice gloss and it maintains that that extreme color look at that Oh my gosh, look at that, and I'm just tapping it out. So you could just take your lipstick, you know, and dot it a couple times on your lips, and then just spread it out, which I almost wonder if that's not what it was intended for, but I don't know. I'm wiping them off my hand here, okay? See, I'm taking this towel, and I'm scrubbing my hand. You can see my skin moving. And look at, do you see the stain it left? Yeah, baby. Very, very good products. Very good quality. I'm super excited, and and now I'm going to have to be hounding my, what was it, Walgreens or CVS? CVS, until they get the other two colors in, because I feel like I just might die if I don't get them. <laughs> Again, $6.49, outstanding price for an even more outstanding product. And the next thing I wanted to talk to you about is another Milani product, and this is another lip line. This is all part of their 2014 Spring Collection. And these ones are called the Milani Power Lip Lasting and Moisturizing Gloss Stain. And these come in a little bitty tube. Perfect, you know, let's see, as compared to this one. It's not much smaller, except this one's little and round. 
And this comes in eight different colors. This one was the only friggin' one that was on the shelves down there. <laughs> Although it did look like it had been picked over a little bit, so I won't diss them too bad, you know. But, um, yeah, this was the only one that was left, and this is called Strawberry Sugar. Strawberry Sugar. I... The, the formula seems the same. Now, I don't know if it's the same or not. I, I don't know for sure. I tried to do a little bit of research, but there was no telling, really, if the formula was the same. But it seems the same. Incredibly pigmented. I mean, we are talking some serious, serious pigment here. Can you see that? Look at that. I mean, there it doesn't get any more opaque than these three items. It really doesn't. I've... I have yet to come across, and but I'm not, you know, I don't really go for the real opaque stuff. But I love these so much, I just had to. <laughs> and see, look, and when I shear that down a little bit by tapping it with my finger, look how beautiful that is. So, I mean, you could certainly have a full-on Nicki Minaj lip, or you could, you know, blend it all down and just have a nice little kissable pout. Oh, I just love them. And I will be getting the rest of these. Now, the applicator tip is a little, um, let me wipe this off so you can see it. It's a little brush. And i got to say, that I'm not real thrilled with. You see that? It's kind of like the Dream Lumi's under eye concealer. It's got that little brush on it. Um, it, it doesn't make for a good uh, lay down. You know, it's kind of streaky and... And um, you can't, I don't feel like you can get a really fine line, but the truth of the matter is, in any lip product I use, I always use a lip liner because I've got such a small amount of real estate on my upper lip that I have to be very careful with what I do, you know, or it's just going to bleed into my upper lip. So, gorgeous product. All, both of them are just absolutely beautiful. But I got to tell you, I'm not as happy. Oh, and this is six forty nine too. These are both $6.49. Outstanding price for what you're getting. But I'm not as excited about them as I am about this. This is Milani. And is their anti-feathering lip liner. It is transparent. There's just the only one. I don't believe that I could tell. And I went on the website and looked around. And they don't come in any different colors. It's just a transparent lip liner. I'm telling you, <laughs> I put these things around my lips, and I put so much of this on that you could almost see the the gravity holding the product on my lips, and it did not run into my lines. In all of my 46 years, well, 20 plus of them being, uh, you know, a lip liner wearer, I guess, and certainly for the last 10 years, I have been on the hunt for a lip liner that would truly do what it said. I've tried Stila's, Urban Decay, um, uh, Pertis Napoleon, I've, I mean, I've just, I've tried them all. And after a while, you know, at first they do okay, I guess, but after a while, they just wear off and you got to reapply and you end up going through one of these a week with as much lipstick as I wear. So, I just haven't been really impressed, you know, and I just end up going back to my lip liners and, you know, and I don't really like to use lip liners because I feel like I've got to take up part of the real estate on my lip that I don't really have to spare on my top lip anyway. This is gorgeous gorgeous ladies any of you aging gals out there like myself if you want to wear these beautiful vibrant in your face gorgeous colors but you just can't because you know you've got lines in your lips for whatever reason I used to smoke I smoked for 10 years thank god I never drank out of a straw you know I'm I'm a rocks right on the rocks baby <laughs> but if I drank out of a straw I'd probably be you know who knows what I'd look like my mouth would probably look like a butthole or something, but <laughs> this is a beautiful product. You guys have got to go out and get this. It is by far, by far, hands down, the absolute best lip liner that I have ever owned, ever. Ever, ever, ever. It is absolutely gorgeous. The only one complaint that I would have with this is if, that it's not retractable. You have to sharpen it, and we all know you lose a lot of product when you do that. But other than that, absolutely beautiful. Um, you can use it as a primer on your whole lip if you want, and it doesn't budge. <laughs> if you use this stuff on your whole lip, it whatever you put on your lip is not budging off. It, not even not even so much when you want to take it off. you got to really exfoliate your lips to get it off. It's just a fantastic product. I could not be happier. So that is my very short review. You guys run down and grab you some of these new Milani products. The Lip Intense Liquid Colors. Four different colors. There's a coral and a red one. And 
purple and pink, the anti-feathering lip liner, and the, I keep forgetting the name of this one, the Milani Power Lip. And this one comes in eight different shades, a big wide variety of shades. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful products. I can't say enough good things about them, and I can't wait until I can get them all in my collection. <laughs> okay. I love you all so much, and next video will be announcing the winner. And I'm not sure if I'm going to load this one before that or not, so maybe I'll retract that all together. Okay, I love you all so much, and please stay tuned for more videos that I have filmed on um, some really good tr uh, tricks to do with your lashes. Um, I filmed the contouring video. Um, these were all upon request, so, um, and some DIYs, and I've just got a lot of good stuff planned, so um, we'll see you in my next video.